The theme for this year's Dick Sporting Goods Pittsburgh Marathon is get ready to move, move yourself, move heartbeats, move barriers. Yeah, it could also be move lots and lots of stuff <laughs> because we're live this morning at the Marathon Warehouse in the Strip and we're getting a look at the amazing amount of inventory it takes to put on a marathon. Let's check back in with Mikey Hood for more of Marathon by the Numbers. Hey, Mikey. You're right, David. There is a lot of inventory here at the P3R warehouse. Look at, we have some road blocker thingamajiggies. We have cones. We have all of this stuff here. Look, even rakes. I wonder what they use rakes for. Probably to clean up a bunch of stuff. We have shovels. I mean, there is stuff everywhere. So now it's time for the quiz. Dan right. is going to give me a quiz on the numbers, right? You're a numbers right. man. I am a numbers All right. guy. I love Here we numbers. go. I practiced. It's important to stay hydrated, right? So how much fluid do you think we have on the course? Okay, fluid, fluid, fluid. People like water. 40,000 participants, right? So I'm going to guess, I don't know, 15,000 gallons of water. We actually have, you're close. We're, we actually have 20,000 gallons of water and another 12,000 gallons of noon. Endurance mix on course, and what's amazing is that's served up in 480,000 cups. If oh you believe gosh, that, that's a lot. It is a lot. <laughs> it is a lot. And then when people finish, they're going to want something to eat. So everybody loves Eaton Park cookies. They're actually not here because we serve, we get them fresh to the finish line. So how many Eaton Park cookies do you think we have? All right, everybody loves a smiley cookie, and because you just ran a race and you worked off all those calories, not everyone's going to want a smiley cookie. So I'm thinking maybe like 10,000 smiley cookies? A little bit more than that. We're going to have 22,000 Eaton Park cookies. We're going to have 32,000 Giant Eagle bananas, another 60,000 water bottles from GNC, and 22,000 bagels from uh, Panera. Oh my God, that's a lot of food lot. and smiley cookies, but people love it, I'm sure. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, we also have a lot of other supplies, including uh, porta potties. So have you been thinking about how many porta potties we have on the course? I have been thinking about the porta potties. Um, I'm going to guess 200, I don't know, 200, 200 porta potties, right? That's <laughs> you, you might be waiting in line a while if we only had 200. <laughs> oh, we have 700. 700? 700 porta potties, wow. that's right. That's um, one of my uh, favorite things, though, is the number of safety pins. So we use the safety pins uh, so people can pin their numbers on their, um, on their chest. How many do you think we go through? Well, if you have 40,000 participants, then you need 40,000 safety pins. That makes sense. Uh, we're going to use a little bit more than one safety pin per person, though. So there's about 156,000. Oh, how many? Maybe even a little more. How 150, many? 156,000 safety pins. Wow, that's a lot of safety pins. People are taking more than one, clearly, right? Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> As you can um, see, there's, there's a lot happening here at the warehouse. Dan, thank you so much for all you. of the information. We're two weeks away. We're super excited. It's yeah. going to be a spectacular event. I'm sure it will. And so I'm exhausted. I haven't even run anywhere. And from all of this counting, I need a break. <laughs> Back to you guys in the studio. Mikey, thank you. And David, you realized something when she was getting the facts about the cups. What did I realize? That there are more cups for the marathon than oh, there are more people than in, the in the city limit of, of Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh, the population. Yeah. There are yeah. More cups used. Math okay. blows me away. It <laughs> yeah. All right. We have another number for you. The Dick's Sporting Goods Pittsburgh Marathon weekend is just 11 days away. And there's still time to get involved running or volunteering. Keep watching for more reports as we lead up to the race weekend right here on PTL and online at PittsburghTodayAlive.com.